Welcome to Common Sense TV. I'm your host, E.T. Williams, the doctor of common sense. Now, if you're watching this on YouTube, there are some videos we put on uh, on our other station and uh, our platform that we will not put on YouTube because you already know why we can't put it on YouTube. But if you're subscribed here, make sure you go over and subscribe to us on Rumble and uh, you can subscribe to the website because we put videos up there we don't put anywhere else. But some of the videos we don't put on uh, YouTube, uh, we actually still put on Rumble. Because you can't put these type of truth uh, uh, videos on YouTube. You know why. But uh, Joe Biden was giving another speech, and he actually said something that I agree with him on. He says that all his buddies either were firefighters, they were cops, or they were priests. He said he wasn't qualified. For any of them, so here he is. I went to a little school called Holy Rosary Grade School across from McClaymont Fire Hall. And all my buddies that came either became a firefighter, a cop, or a priest. I wasn't qualified for any of them, so here I am. But, uh, <laughs> you know. Look what he's saying. He wasn't qualified to be a firefighter, a cop, or a priest. And he thinks he's qualified to be the president? Are you freaking kidding me? I mean, are you freaking kidding me? Can you name anything that Joe Biden is really qualified for? You say you want to run a snow cone machine. Could Joe Biden run a snow cone machine? Say you want to be the kind of uh, uh, usher that just take people to their seats like they used to do in the movie theater, escort you to your seat. You think Joe Biden could take you to your seat? Could Joe Biden work the drive through at McDonald's? I mean, you can't name it. Shoveling horse manure. He probably would eat the horse He's manure. Scooping poop. Yes, it's a unique punishment in Lake County. Judge Michael Ticanetti sentenced this man, Bailey Toth, to clean animal stalls around the Lake County fairgrounds. Now, Toth was found guilty of criminal mischief for tipping over a porta potty, knocking down a Wi Fi bridge, and walking on top of a vehicle. There's nothing really that Joe Biden is qualified for, but he's always making up these lies, and I notice he never gets fat checked. He was talking about something about lightning struck a pond behind his house and it came through the ground into the air, air conditioning system, and everything was ruined. In other words, some fire burned down his house. Zero evidence. The local fire department volunteers to, to get them out and get them to the hospital and they saved their lives. In addition to that, what happened was uh, I, uh, I, was, uh, I, I was doing Meet the Press and... Uh, Lightning struck in a little pond behind my house, came up through the ground into the air conditioning system, ended up generating thick black smoke, literally, literally that of those proportions. And from the basement to the third floor, the attic, everything was ruined. And the kitchen floor, we almost lost a couple of firefighters, they tell me, because the kitchen floor was the burning between the beams in, in, in the house, in addition to almost collapsed into the basement. And then, uh, and then I was, uh, I got rushed to the hospital for a, turned out to be almost a nine hour operation with a cranial aneurysm in the middle of a snowstorm by my fire company. They got me down. They saved my life. And so I owe you and so many other Americans owe you as well. So many families. None factual evidence to prove this. Just like there were no evidence to prove he grew up in a Puerto Rican community. And between all minorities, we have 20% of our state is minority. And so I, uh, I uh, was sort of raised uh, in the Puerto Rican community at home politically. Just like there was no evidence that he ever met somebody named Corn Pop and had an altercation with them. <laughs> and Corn Pop was a bad dude. And he ran a bunch of bad boys. And I did. Yeah. He drove 18 wheelers. He marched with men. Anyway, and if we I don't do drive an 18 wheeler, man. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I wish oh, yeah. Yeah. 30 years ago, Nelson Mandela walked out of prison and entered into discussions about apartheid. I had the great honor of meeting him. I had the great honor of being arrested with our UN ambassador on the streets of Soweto trying to get to see him on Robbins Island. The man lies time and time again, and nobody facts check him. Now, if you told Joe Biden, I'm going to give you a job just walking up steps. He's not even good at that. He said all his buddies, and I bet he's lying about all his buddies. All his buddies was either firefighters, cops, or priests. 
he wasn't qualified. Of course you wasn't. You graduated butt naked last in your class in college and you were cheating. All without credit. Joseph Biden admitted today that he committed plagiarism when he was in law school. He said it was a mistake, but that it was unintentional. He quoted five pages of someone else's work without proper citation. And he's about to have his 80th birthday. So in other words, it's about to get worse. COVID has taken this year, just since the outbreak, it's taken more than 100 years. Jackie, are you here? Where's Jackie? I didn't think she was, she was going to be here. From the time I got to the Senate 720 years ago, Joe Biden can't speak clearly. He can't think clearly. So he tells law enforcement, you got to do something about this guy, Trump. He's killing me. Worse. His cognitive decline is way past. The only thing left for him to do is put a bib on him to stop him from slobbering on himself. He was passing gas uh, uh, with dignitaries over in the UK. Everything Joe Biden does, he rides a bicycle, he forgets to put his feet down, he falls. When he enters the room, the cue card people got to tell him to not only speak to people, but sit down because he's not smart enough to sit down on his own. And now he wants us to believe that he wasn't qualified for a firefighter, a cop, or a priest, but he's qualified to be the president. I think we're done with the conversation. He just admitted what we already knew. He's not qualified to be the president because technically he's not in charge of anything anyway.